So match is starting right now. All Back right. to the match. So it's a starting peaceful day. Peaceful day in Smashville. Yeah, one of the most fair stage in. Um, actually, it's it is the fair stage in uh, Smash Four. Well, you have uh, the final destiny. Yeah. Destination, final destination. Is that moving platform. Um, Okay, so it got the down smash failed. Yeah. Oh, that's that's a pretty good fair. You landed by Ethan. All right. So it's pretty much an even game. They're pretty much um, going for straight up punishes. Um, not really too much neutral. They're just really going ham. <coughs> There's a thing that um, the Captain Falcon have to watch out for as. Falco uses his side B that it has a meteor effect and yeah, it definitely. can kill her. Alright. Pretty interesting exchange over there. Between an up smash. There. Okay. Punish dash attack from Captain Falcon. Alright. Someone's aiming too hard on that. Oh! <laughs> When meteor. you get too greedy for the meteor smash, you and tend to die actually. Yeah, that's true. But I played, I played against uh, his Captain Falcon. How, how, wh what do you feel about it? Is it's it very surprising. At random time, suddenly, boop, a critical strike from the knee. That's it. Uh, yeah, did. Oh, definitely. So he's a pretty spent, spontaneous uh, Captain Falcon player. That's actually not very unexpected, right? I mean. Falcon players tend to go wild. That's one of the yeah. healing factors of playing Falcon. Most of the times when I like come to these competitions and tournaments, yeah. I see a lot of Captain Falcons. Like at least there'll be two of them. <laughs> I highly doubt there's just two. I mean even Sal right here plays Captain Falcon. Shout outs to Daryl. What's up Daryl? Where you at Daryl? Come on. No response. Alright. Okay. It's kind of busy. So, uh, the side smash ended Falco's life. Oh, right. It was actually a punish. I see. Okay. But right now... Um, Aim's fishing for grabs. Yeah. You gotta okay. get the the reads on. Yeah. It appears that Captain Falcon is losing, but he's, he knows how to use a shield. Alright. Right. Smash for anything goes. I mean, once, once the person goes into a... Uh, Completely negative mental state. I feel like comebacks really do happen. A lot of, of comebacks. Yeah, it's like it's a phenomenon that when you you got you're down to your oh, second stop. That's stock. a nice down tilt right there. It's a it's yeah. a very All right. phenomenon. Back air. Hype. Anyways, as I was speaking, okay. the there's a weird phenomenon in Smash Four that is when you are down to your second stock and your opponent is still on his first stock. You somehow get this major power, and then you can, like, kill him real quick. Is that subjective to your opinion, or is that what you've observed? Ever? It's something I mean, like, uh, is that a consensual? Opinion? No, it's not consensual. All right, so, uh, at hunch, least huh? how I feel. All right. But it's not technic. It's technically not true because uh, some sometimes when the when you lose your you're on your second stock and the person's on your first stock, they may build up rage. Because they are at a high percentage. Alright. So for those who don't know what rage is, um, when you are at a higher percentage, you deal more damage. Yeah. So if you are shocked, I think Buster would be very useful, right? <laughs> Definitely. Oh, there's a character switch. So um, he switched off from Captain Falcon right. to Sorry, a Mario. Sorry, we weren't paying attention to the match, but... Okay, so... so um, for Mario, I, I heard that it's a dash attack for days. Right. I, I see the stage spike kind of failed. <laughs> yeah. He's a very archetypal, um, pretty much one of the rudimentary characters in Smash 4, don't you think so? Yes. I mean, Mario's very basic. He's, I feel he's like the Marth of um, me what Marth is to melee. You know, he has a um, decent range of projectiles. Yes. Uh, as in with his fireball. And he got um, good... He, he has his own gimmicks. Um, like the cake. You know, yeah, the cake. Are when you're coming back to recover on stage, you use the kick, and then oh, they, yeah. they will miss the ledge, especially Peach, <laughs> because uh, she can only grab the ledge only when the parasail is facing it. Uh, so if you use the cape, well, good luck to you. So beautiful S-Smash ending the first stop of Mario right here. 
So there isn't. So right now there's an improvement. Oh wow. Oh, the up smash. That, that was a good read. With yeah. Smash. All right. So um, there's a bit of a difference. Um, as you can see just now with Falcon, he's been on a losing end for most parts. This is considerably e equal. So would you consider him a more proficient Mario player, or is this your first time seeing him play Mario? Uh, this is my first time seeing him play oh, Mario. All right. So it's his hidden bag of tricks. For for my opinion, for Mario is that you don't use his front air that much because it takes like time to charge. Right. It doesn't necessarily charge, but it takes a long time to come up. All right. Okay, so this is a good match so far. Um, Ethan is punishing him really well, and and there you it go. go. And of uh, and that was one. end of the match. <laughs> One of the pools down here. That was fast. All right. All right. Do we have any other matches, or is it just oh, one yeah, console? Oh yeah, we're gonna have matches here definitely. As in one console, or do we have many? Because uh, right now, where we are in oh, Subject yeah. City, we have four consoles. Uh, unfortunately, we can't like stream all four. <laughs> so and like switch. <laughs> uh, I mean, like we're just gonna focus on one. Um